name is Danny Morrison. That's right. Get a picture of it if you can. While wow, it's hot, like a plate of cookies. But these cookies aren't made by Girl Scouts. They're made by soldiers and warriors and veterans. You're sitting in a good chair, buddy, aren't you? You know what? You know why you're not sitting in that chair? Because you're not dangerous enough to sit in that chair. You're almost dangerous enough, so you're in the almost there chair. By the end of the night, you'll graduate to the electric chair, where you'll be guilty as charged! Woo! So that was combat dancing that you just saw, tasted, consumed, saturated your souls with. Ow! Yeah, you know it, toots. <laughs> and uh, I instructed, along with the war doll. <laughs> you know, uh, would you hold the war doll? Yeah, really Don't get kinky with the war doll. You're not afraid of Mario, I mean. No. Well, the war doll, he's just like a natural force. Like wind or sunshine. <laughs> I got a thing for redheads. Yes. Your hair's red, right? It's very red. Yeah. <laughs> Just kick, don't talk. <laughs> so tonight I'm gonna I'm gonna demonstrate some moves of combat dancing. Uh, you know, the, the thing about when you come into my dojo to learn combat dancing, just remember one thing. There can be only one Danny Morsel. Last time there existed two Danny Morsels. Uh, you see, because the problem is, is that it's, it's just so hot. Like, nowhere on the earth could handle the heat of two Danny Morsels. The last time that happened, it was shot into space. And it became what you now know as the sun. <laughs> Or this stage light here. Good lord, this thing is burning my ass. <laughs> Nothing for pictures. Thank you, good of you. Uh, Alright, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna do some moves, but I need uh, an assistant. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the move. <laughs> Who wants to, uh, wants to come up on stage? You! Come on, flower haired lady, get on up here. Get on up here! Get on up here! Who wants this? Jen, flower to get on stage. Good of you. What's your name? Mike Lamar. Yes. Lamar? Likes Lamar. Lamar. As in uh, French for the love? Yes. You know, the war doll's not seeing anybody. <laughs> I'd like to escort him to the Bahamas or whatever. He's available. All right, now what I need you to do, I need you to stand right up here. A little more, and um, I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some props. Just stand and look beautiful. Shouldn't, yeah. be, shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, yeah like the more kick his ass. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, legs. Did just someone say that Lamore is gonna kick my ass? <laughs> Whoever said that, remember one thing: you mess with me, you mess with the war doll. <laughs> You mess with the war doll, he will rip his mustache off and impregnate you with it. <laughs> Doesn't care if he's your dude, he'll find a way. <laughs> so that's pretty scary, huh? Oh, very scary. Gosh. What do you do during the day besides being beautiful, Lamar? <laughs> oh, she's a laugher. She's a professional giggler. Oh, I love it. Lamar, here's what I need you to do. Uh, you're CEO of Chuckle Incorporated, aren't you? <laughs> that is correct. Don't dare answer my stupid questions. They're, they'll lead us nowhere to defeat and sorrow. <laughs> Lamore, I would love to get into a fight with every single person in this room, but instead... <laughs> but instead, I'm gonna fight pictures of things that I don't like. <laughs> and I don't mean the art hanging on the wall. <laughs> because I like it! Yeah. <laughs> Enemies from all angles, from all sides, people. Remember that. A combat dancer has many enemies. Hold on to this. This is a picture of wet bread. <laughs> yeah. 
I hate wet bread. Because the more doll, the more we believe that bread should never be wet before it goes into your mouth. Now, uh, hey, Mr. Kisser, hand me, hand me my lady right there. Yeah, oh yeah, throw it like a man. See, I want to put combat dancing into a context. So let's say, Lamore, that you were at a cafe and you're dancing with somebody that you love and all of a sudden a piece of wet bread creeps up onto you. How would you handle a situation like that? I'm gonna show you. DJ, when I give you the point and tickle, I'm on track two. The name of this move, by the way, is called making it happen in a dangerous fashion. It's, which in some countries it's also known as early retirement. See how this works. Jerk is circus, these sort of things happen. You'll get paid through the tip jar if you. Jeez. Oh man, that was a goodie. You know, something about Danny Morsel Lamore is that uh, I'm so fierce. Legs Lamore. Legs Lamore. Well, know this that when I was three years old, I was so fierce that I started using speed stick. Yeah, that's right. So fierce. And in the morning, I don't drink coffee or tea, legs no more. I drink cologne. And when I belch, my house smells like victory. And with that, we're gonna do one more picture here. Something else that I hate, corners. I hate corners. You know, if I had my way, every house would be a silo. There's nothing that I own that I want to put into a corner. No, I hate corners. It wastes of space. The only time I saw a corner work is when there was a robot suffering from leprosy in a corner. That was the only time a corner worked out for me. So this last move is, let's say it's, uh, you know, we're at, the, we're at the disco buffet. And a corner creeps up on us while we're dancing with our lady at the disco buffet. What are we going to do about it? Not yet, sweetheart. <laughs> so this move is called, poetically, You're Gonna Die. And DJ, when I give you the fist of danger, please play track three. Folks, I was and will continue to be Danny Morso. 